Sipa, good evening. Now, we expected the Queen to be interred in the early hours of this morning. It is, in fact, happening tomorrow morning in the early hours. So just talk us through the revised timeline of what is happening when at the, and what's going on right now. <coughs> I can tell you that what is happening currently at Guakangela Mankenga and Royal Palace is that you've got various leaders of various church groups coming here to pray and have prayer services and sessions. They are basically trying to console the Zulu royal family members. Let me tell you that the issue about when the Queen's remains were going to be interred emanated from the statement that was issued out by the royal family, giving an indication that the internment was going to happen at the crack of dawn on Thursday. Actually, they meant at the crack of dawn on Friday. So before 3 a.m. tomorrow, that internment should have happened by that time. But mourners continue to trickle in here to Guakangela Manking and the Royal Palace. We have seen Amabuto, we have seen the maidens. All of them are coming in here to pay their respects and also to be with the family up until midnight when that selected few group of people will go to the burial site for the internment of the late Queen Richard. Let me tell you that I've spotted one of the king's wives from Enyogene Royal Palace, Sundrungkulu, Queen Mamkiza, arriving here to pay her respects. Earlier on, I saw another of the queen's wife, if my memory serves me well, that was Queen Smongile Madlamini from Waketom Tandayo Royal Palace. She has since left, but she was here earlier on. So you have queens coming here to support this family, but also you have high-profile politicians like the mm. minister responsible for cooperative governance and traditional affairs, Dr. Nkosazana Tlamini Zuma, the premier of Guazuru Natal, Sikles Zigalala was here. There is that planning meeting which will talk to the issue of tomorrow for the official provincial funeral, but the story moves now. The attention after tomorrow moves to the issue of succession. Many people don't want to talk about that, but the royal family members concede that that cannot be avoided, especially bearing in mind that the statement they released said there will be no leadership vacuum. We earlier on asked Prince Mangosu Tubutelezi about what will happen now when it comes to the issue of succession. This is what he had to say. I applaud what the king did because he has made it very simple. I don't think that we're going to crack our heads. I mean, we're not going to have our choice to elect who should be, you know. It, everything will happen in accordance. All this that is left for us to interpret what it means by leaving a, a will naming uh, the, the queen. So the, 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 the matter is quite simple and straightforward. And I cannot say more than that. Sutu Butelezi speaking there earlier. Sipaman Logoga, thank you so much for giving us the very latest from Kwanongoma.